Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 6193 in Candy Crush Saga, where we have 23 moves to clear out 102 jelly. If you find these videos helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. That in turn would really help me out. So let's take a look at this. <laughs> we've got this pyramid shape down here and this rectangle here, and we've got conveyor belts in both areas. We've got these rainbow twists, some of them more bound up than others, but they're not connected. Although the conveyor belt could really change that. If this goes this way, at least these two will be connected. Yeah, this looks a little bit bizarre. I think what I have to do, oh, and I've got stripe dispensers. This is my plan going forward here. I'm going to try to make moves low to the ground to encourage cascading, try to use any stripes that show up, not worry about whether or not these guys are connected. They're going to keep changing their bonds. That's okay. I'm going to clear this out until I can make a way down here. And that's my goal, is getting down here as quickly as possible. Maybe with some of these stripes or a wrapped candy or something. If I can get combos, match up these stripes with something else, that would be wonderful and fantastic. Ooh, yeah, like this. Now I'm going to be setting this off in a place that isn't particularly good, but I'm going to be using this along the edges, and that's nice, and it brought more stripes here. And there's still not much room for things to slide through, but we're getting there. I'm not even paying attention to the jelly up here, but guess what? I think I don't need to. I think it's gone. All right, let's see. I could put these two together. That's not a bad choice. But I think I'll just go ahead and make more stripes because I've got multiple layers here to get through. Ooh, let's do this. There we go. Now we're starting to get some good stuff down there. Still have to snap these guys all up. Oh, I like the horizontal stripes. I don't get horizontal stripes from here. But if I can make some and bring them down here or create them down here, that can be spectacular because they go into these edges. So I'm going to look for those opportunities. I can make a raft here, but now that I'm down here, I want to stay over here. I'm going to make this raft. It's going to blow up, but it's going to take a lot of stuff with it as it goes. So now we only have, well, let's wait until this turn is done to tabulate here. Now we only have 11 jelly. I could make this stripe, but I would lose the opportunity, well, no, I wouldn't lose it. It would remain. It would just be delayed. But it would be hard to get this stripe to wait and come all the way around here. I don't think it's worthwhile. So I'm going to keep working in here. Instead of doing this, because it is trapped now off of the conveyor belt, I'm going to make the moves that I have available that are over to the edges and hope, there we go, that things fall through on their own. And look at this. When we make a lot of these moves here, we get some interesting friends to help us. Going to make a wrapped candy. If this takes off on its own, I'll be okay with that because it'll still take out the most prevalent color. I need three more jelly. One, two, three. And they're all blue. I could just take out all blue and that would leave me with two jellies at the most. This also has a good chance of blowing up, but I do have this wrapped wrapped combo that would go to waste here, and it's not, it would take this out, but it can't reach this, and this is the double thick. So I'm actually going to do this first, and then see if I want to use this somehow. Well, now this is purple, and this is green, so that doesn't work out spectacularly, but... I'm going to do this, take out at least this, and maybe get some cascading to help. And if not, I've got some backup that may still be around at the end of this turn. Or may blow up. We will have to wait to see. There we go. Okay, so that's how I get this done on the first playthrough with six moves left. Hopefully it is as easy for you as it is for me. I'm not worried about any of the jelly up here. I'm worried about the blockers here. Just focusing on taking those out. And when that happens, then working down here as much as I can, keeping an eye at what's happening up here. 
If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.